Hello everyone. I am Balaji Rao. Welcome to BR Max class. In this class, we will check the given relation R in set of all natural numbers is reflexive or symmetric or transitive. We will check the given relation is reflexive or symmetric or transitive. Okay. First, we will try to understand what is given relation. The given relation is set of all ordered pairs such that y equal to x plus 5. This relation is defined on what set? This relation is defined on set of all natural numbers. We know what are natural numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and so on. These are all natural numbers. R is a relation which is defined like this it contains ordered pair x comma y such that y equal to x plus 5 and important thing is they mention that x is less than 4 this relation is given in set builder method if i write this relation in roster method we can easily identify this relation is reflexive or symmetric or transitive so I'll write this relation in roster form first. How to write this relation in roster form? What is x? x is an element in n. That means x is a natural number. What is y? y is also an element in set n. That means y is also a natural number. And you observe for the element x, they are given a condition. x is less than 4. So first I'll start with x equal to 1. When x equal to 1, what is y? Please observe here. If x equal to 1, what is y? y is equals to 1 plus 5. 1 plus 5 is what? 6. If x equal to 2, you write x equal to 2, what is y? 2 plus 5. 2 plus 5 is 7. x equal to 3. Take x equal to 3. 3 plus 5. 3 plus 5 is what? 8. Now what to take? x equal to 4. Can we take x equal to 4? You observe here, they clearly mention that x is less than 4. That means you cannot take x equal to 4. So this is the relation we got when we write given relation in roster form. Now we will check that is this relation is reflexive or symmetric or transitive. First we will check reflexive property. What is the definition of reflexive property? For every x in set A implies ordered pair x comma x is there in the relation then we say that that relation is reflexive relation now you observe here you take an element 1 in set n ordered pair 1 comma 1 is there in this relation no it is not there so we say that this relation is not reflexive how we will write the answer for this for 1 in natural numbers if we take ordered pair 1 comma 1 is there in the relation no, ordered pair 1 comma 1 does not belong to the relation. So we say that R is not reflexive. The relation R is not a reflexive relation. Now we will check the symmetric property. Is this relation is symmetric or not? To understand this symmetric property, first we must know what is symmetric uh, condition. We will take an ordered pair A comma B in the relation R, in the given relation R. If ordered pair b comma a is also there in the relation, then we say that the given relation is symmetric. You observe here the ordered pair 1 comma 6. Ordered pair 1 comma 6 is there in the relation R. Yes, ordered pair 1 comma 6 is there in the relation. Ordered pair 6 comma 1 is also there in the relation. Check it. Ordered pair 6 comma 1 is also there in the relation. No, ordered pair 6 comma 1 does not belongs to the R. So it fails to satisfy symmetric property so what we say we say that r is not symmetric r is not a symmetric relation okay now we'll check a trans to relation this is little tricky one you please listen carefully how to check this relation is transitive or not what is trans to relation? First, we will identify a pair of ordered pairs which are of the form a comma b and b comma c. We will identify a pair of ordered pairs which is of the form a comma b and b comma c. You observe here, first order pair ends with b, second order pair starts with b. We will choose such type of order pairs 
and we will check that ordered pair a comma c is there in the relation or not okay now you see here first you take order pair 1 comma 6 it ends with 6 is there any other order pair starts with 6 no okay no problem just leave this order pair and come to the second order pair it ends with 7 is there any other order pair which starts with 7 is there any other order pair which starts with 7 no okay no problem leave it come to this third order pair this ends with 8 is there any other order pair which starts with 8 no so this is little controversial statement you may feel what i am saying is wrong but you take it granted that if we are unable to find a pair of ordered pairs which are of the form a comma b and b comma c if you are unable to find such ordered pair then we say that that relation is transitive if you are unable to find a pair of order pair which are of the form a comma b and b comma c you observe we are unable to find here this you take this one comma six is there any other starts with six no you take second one it ends with seven is there any other starts with seven no you take this one it ends with eight is there any other starts with eight no so what happened we are unable to find a pair of the form a comma b and b comma c so in such case if you are unable to find a pair which is of the form a comma b and b comma c in such case we say that the relation r is transitive relation so what we'll write here clearly clearly r is transitive relation why we are writing here r is a transitive relation because we are unable to find a pair of the form a comma b and b comma c this is very very important point so the given relation r we verified that we identified that it is not reflexive not symmetric and it is transitive relation i hope you understand this class if you like this class please press like button and share this video with your friends and if you have any doubts please comment in comment session and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel to get more updates thank you